Here in Moab, we have a unique privilege of being able to drive our street legal UTVs out to the trails. Not all states allow UTVs to travel on designated roadways and on paved roadways. For your UTV to be street legal in Moab, you need a license plate, turn signals, rear view mirrors, an effective muffler, a driver's license, and insurance to operate as a street legal ATV. Besides the equipment for a UTV to be street legal, it must have a DMV issued license plate from your home state and meet all Utah street legal requirements. If your home state does not issue license plates to UTVs, your vehicle cannot be street legal in Utah and it must be trailered or towed to the trailheads. If your vehicle is not street legal, you also need to purchase a non-resident OHV permit, either online or in town. If your UTV is street legal in Moab, no permits are required to ride the trails. Choosing to operate a non-street legal UTV on the roadways could lead to the issuance of citations. If your UTV isn't street legal, you can rent one. If you rent a UTV, it's still important that you understand the rules of driving through our neighborhoods and the ethics of our trails. UTVs driving through town have become an issue because there are so many people visiting our small town. UTV noise in Moab is a problem. Many of Moab's popular trails are accessed through residential neighborhoods. So you can imagine having 1,500 side-by-sides pass by your house every day. It's important to be extra courteous about driving through neighborhoods at night. Plan your trail rides so that you can avoid it. For these areas, we've dropped the speed limit down to 15 miles an hour. If you break the speed limit in Moab, you can be sighted. I think an important thing that the UTV community can do to help and assist our community with the, the noise issue is to simply obey the speed limits as they're posted in, in our neighborhoods. The loudest thing you can do on your UTV is accelerating hard. So in Moab, slow down. Don't accelerate fast. Avoid residential neighborhoods, especially at night. Be respectful, be courteous, and be a good steward of our sport.